Hey guys, what's going on? I am super excited to tell you about my virtual and in-person coaching program, uh, nutrition coaching program that I'm going to be doing this coming January. Now, today's video is gonna be specifically about the virtual version. So this is anyone who either doesn't live in Bakersfield with me or anyone who just doesn't have the time to commit to physically going to a location and wants to reap the benefits of the virtual nutrition coaching program. So a couple of things to start off with. This nutrition coaching program is for beginners to intermediate levels, okay? So what do I mean by that and how would I define that? So a beginner is somebody who really doesn't know not only what proteins, carbs, and fats are and how to structure them, but how to consistently eat the foods that are on the healthier end and flex that with foods that are, aren't so healthy. So having a more flexible approach. Um, if you haven't been able to conquer your weight loss goals and you continually go on like a fad diet and then you know maybe it actually works for you while you're on it but afterwards it doesn't work for you then um, like you gain the weight back then this is a perfect program for you okay but our main goal our main overview is going to be is that we're going to be learning and practicing how to structure our proteins carbs and fats in a way that allows us to eat not only healthy foods, but also reduce the amount of total calories we're eating by prioritizing foods that make us feel good, that we actually enjoy, and that doesn't feel so overwhelming. Okay, my goal is to not say, hey, only eat these foods and you're gonna get results, because that might work, but it's not a long-term sustainable process. So I wanna teach you and educate you on how to make this work best for you. No food is off limits, okay? What we're gonna be doing instead, and I'll give an example later, but what we're gonna be doing instead is trying to introduce a more structured form of eating that also has enough flexibility so you don't always feel like obligated to eat the healthiest thing, that's not my goal. My goal is to find balance, to find a structure that's flexible enough so that in certain life events or life situations you can make adjustments, but the majority of the time you are preparing your own food, you're making your own food, you're well aware of what uh, ingredients are going into your food and you're taking responsibility as much as you possibly can. All right, This is not a program that won't allow you to go out with your friends once a week or to go out for drinks every now and then. Um, that's not what I'm trying to limit here. What I'm trying to do is introduce you to a healthier lifestyle and make it flexible so that it's more sustainable. All right, cool. Um, the only last thing in this kind of introduction, inter introduction is that I want to mention that we will not be counting calories, all right? That's not what this program's about. That will come in a future program for those that are in the intermediate going towards advanced level where calorie counting and tracking food will be a little bit more specific. There will be a little bit of tracking uh, of food in this program, but um, it's gonna be on the limited end. Because again, we're trying to prioritize a different approach here. Um, that will come later as your education grows and becomes a lot more um, uh, rudimentary, becomes something that you're actually in the habit of practicing. So we gotta understand where our level is at. And right now, our, this program is for beginners going into that kind of intermediate level or just pure beginners, right? So from the pure beginner level, level all the way to like the very tippy bottom part of the, um, the intermediate, intermediate level. 